fatty liver when the deposition of excess triglyceride in the liver cells occur it causes fatty liver so in the normal condition chylomicron are formed after the lipid absorption this have more triacylglycerol and it transport the triglyceryl to the liver adipose tissue has a restored triacylglycerol which goes into the lipolysis and form the fatty acid this fatty acid enters to the liver and form the triacylglycerol now triacylglycerol are formed from the chylomicron and the fatty acid in the liver this triacylglycerol are excreted out from the liver in the form of the vldl which is transport to the peripheral tissue so it is a normal condition when triacylglycerol are formed in the liver and excrete it out the from the liver but in the some condition when we take high fat so it cause the high formation of the chylomicron this chylomicron has a high tg content and transport to the liver in the some metabolic disorder adipose tissue has a stored triglyceride goes into the more lipolysis and it also form a more fatty acid which goes enter into the liver and form the high triacylglycerol this triacylglycerol are excreted in the form of the vldl but when the vldl synthesis and excretion of vldl are defected so this excretion of triacylglycerol also defected so triacylglycerol are accumulated in the liver cells and it cause fatty liver so when the increased synthesis of triglyceride occur and utilization and excretion of triacylglycerol are defected so it causes the fatty liver stages of fatty liver so when the triacylglycerol are accumulated in the liver it causes the fatty liver after some times these tissues are replaced by the connected tissue and it causes the fibrosis of liver and after some times there is a nodules are formed in the liver and cause cirrhosis liver and when the more alcoholism and in the chronic alcoholism it causes the liver cancer causes of fatty liver so there is a three main cause of fatty liver first is over production of triglyceride reduced utilization of fats and less removal of fat from the liver so first we discuss over production of triglyceride so whenever we intake a high fat diet it causes the more formation of chylomicron and chylomicron has a more triglyceride content so it transport to the liver if the tri liver are not metabolized this triglyceride so it accumulates in the liver and cause the fatty liver in some metabolic disorder like diabetes mellitus alcoholism and in starvation state so there is no insulin in body and if the no insulin in body it cause it favors the lipolysis after the lipolysis more fatty acid and glycerol are formed and it enters into the liver and form the triglyceride in excess and it accumulates and cause the fatty liver second cause of fatty liver so there is a reduced utilization of fat due to alcoholism so in normal alcohol metabolism alcohol converted into the acetaldehyde in the presence of the alcohol dehydrogenase and now this acetaldehyde are converted into the acetic acid by the activity of aldehyde dehydrogenase normal alcohol metabolism require nad plus and this nad plus are more goes into the alcohol metabolism so there There is no availability of NAD plus for TCA cycle. So high high NAD plus consumption in the alcohol metabolism it suppresses the TCA cycle. So suppression of TCA cycle cause accumulation of the acetyl CoA. This acetyl CoA now enters into the lipogenesis and it inhibits the beta oxidation. So lipogenesis form the triacylglycerol. in excess and this excess triglycerol are accumulated in the liver and cause the fatty liver next cause of fatty liver is less removal of fat due to impaired lipoprotein synthesis in normal condition vldl are synthesized in liver which 
transport the triacylglycerol from liver to the adipose tissue and it has apoprotein b and phospholipid so whenever there is a protein energy malnutrition less availability of protein in the body so it not form the apoprotein b and whenever there is a decrease level of choline inositol essential fatty acid which is a lipotrophic factor and mobilize the triacylglycerol from liver to the peripheral tissue are decreased so it cause the no formation of phospholipid and bldl in some toxicity like arsenic toxicity lead and ethylene it also cause the less synthesis of bldl so after the less synthesis of the bldl there is a no excreta excretion of triacylglycerol from the liver to the adipose tissue so it cause the fatty liver due to the impaired lipoprotein synthesis and less removal of fat from the liver so now we discuss symptoms of fatty liver so there is a no main fatty liver symptoms but some symptoms are seen in the patient there is abdominal pain nausea and vomiting and fatigue and diagnosis of fatty liver is a liver function test ultrasound and biopsy and prevention for the fatty liver is to avoid alcohol consumption balance diet and exercise and take antioxidants thank you dosto if you like my videos please like comment and subscribe my channel